Hey, how you doing? Joshua Hamby from Hamby Aeronautics. Today, we're gonna hit another V Skylabs uh, model here. And this is the Mini 500. We're over in, uh, we'll see if you can guess when I spawn in right here. Let's see, I'm going to go on this one. And we're just gonna give this thing a, a little whirl around this area. I don't know if you can figure out where I am based on this uh, building here, uh, but here we go. So, I got the, uh, eh, interesting. Anyway, uh, we're in the green on the RPM, so uh, the, the view, again, it kind of starts a little bit low, so what I, I do for my seat position, I'm just going to I'm up just a little bit, and then I'm going to scoot back just a little bit. I'm in about the right spot, and everything's straight here. So just uh, taking a look inside. Where's my controller go? There it is. Take a look inside. We have. Looks like I got a rate of turn indicator here with an inclinometer ball, airspeed indicator, mag compass, altimeter, EGT gauges. Uh, let's see. Let's see. You got an RPM warning light. Got a VSI. Coolant temp, it's like we're in the green, so that's good. And rotor and engine RPM. And then we have our set of lights, our radio, transponder, fuel shutoff, primer, I got our gas, cyclic, fire extinguisher. Right, pedals work, don't have any toe brakes, so. Uh, I've always, I've seen these online, they're really cool. They're really cool uh, little helicopters, like a, like a equivalent of a mosquito. Oh yeah, there's another mag compass over here. Um, let's see, I got my iPad up there out of the way. I'm just gonna pop outside right here and take a look at the outside. Whoop. So check this thing out. Mini 500. Remember 500 Zulu Zulu. 500 double Zulu. A good experimental here. You got our nav lights on the toes of the skids there. Let's see here. Whoop. Taking a look back here. Looks good. About to get my head in the tail rotor. Just gonna do that. Everything's looking good. This is a, oh geez. This is a really cool model <laughs> helicopter. Uh, so let's see if it flies as good as it looks. Looks like some antenna. All right. Very right, cool. All right, and I'm just gonna lean forward a little bit back in the seat. That actually works pretty well. Just gonna set reset the view forward and then scoot back. Alright. There's the White House. Take a look here. Oh, that feels good. Alright, we got a clockwise, uh, sorry, counterclockwise rotor system, so anticipate a little bit of left pedal. I'm gonna put a little power here. Look in here. Alright. Picking up. And a little less cyclic, a little more less cyclic, and oh. All right, it's about the proper amount of pedal there. Yeah, the I try to get as many frames as I can so my scenery kind of looks a little bit whack, as you can see. But the shadows kind of doing a bit of this and that. I'm not really sure. All right, so here's the White House. And that was a little bit of a pedal turn. Let's go to the left. All right, sweet. Hover power. Uh, let's see, I'm just gonna pop back down here. I was looking, where is, I don't, I don't have any manifold pressure unless I'm blind. Oh, yeah, I can't tell. See how much power I'm pulling. Oh well, oh yeah, I wanted to check this. Eh. Oh, there we go. Let me check this out. 
This would be cool to take these off. There's probably, oh, there we go. Doors off. A little bit louder, so I'll just, uh, I'll put them back on. Shut the door. Very cool, very cool. You can get in either way, this thing. All right, now let's see what kind of power we can pull. I guess we'll just pull until uh, the RPM starts to decrease. All right, up and let's see, the RPM starting to drop there. That's that's all the collective she's got. Not bad. All right, looking good. Trim strings looking good there. Let's see if we can throw it out of trim. String moves, whoop, there we go. All right, now we're just gonna cruise around the monument here. Controllability's nice. It's two bladed, so it's a good mass bump. Yeah. If you look out your window to the left, you'll have the Washington Monument. With the Capitol building down that way, the Jefferson's supposed to be right there, but it's a big hole. And Lincoln down that way. So I'm just cruising around. DCA is over there. A little airport operations. And I think there is a helipad over here somewhere. We'll go over there and do a little approach. I forget the name of it and the identifier, but I, I'm pretty sure it's over here on the on the water here. It may not be there because I don't I don't think I have the buildings and trees all and all that turned up. Um, it's just because I, I'd rather have a good flight than than good scenery, honestly. Um, so here we go. Looking like we're about 350 feet. A little descent going here. All the instruments are looking good. I don't even bother with the radios, honestly, because it's, it's just frustrating in VR with the touch controllers. So maybe if I had something, some hardware, actually, it's a little bit easier. All right, I got a, a stadium here of the baseball. The baseballs. Yeah, I see all my buildings are non-existent. Let's see if our nav lights turn off. Hey, look at that. I'll just leave them on. All right, and we're... I think the helipad's actually over there somewhere. It's, the scenery's really just struggling. Hey, how about a frigate? Whoa. A little high RPM. Uh, all right, let's go land on this. Ease out of the speed here. Little right pedal. And we start to lose some ETL here. Oh, a lot of left side click. Got a 60 in there, I think. All right. Oh, side to the left. Boop. Oh, okay. See, look at my textures, man. They're super garbage. I'll have to fix that. Helicopter looks good, though, and that's what we're that's what we're taking a look at today. So, no big deal there. Uh, all right, let's pick her back up, and uh, let's see. All right, up and scoot back just a little bit. Back a little bit more. All right, I'm gonna pop it down here for just a sec and uh, let's see how it does with ETL. All right, I'm going to just kind of use this platform here. All right, and I'm just gonna bring it to the hover and just ease it forward, let's see what happens. Okay, forward there. There's the balloon. Good, so we'd push through it. Keep it low. A little power. 
and climb out around that 55 mark. Yeah, this is cool. This is a fun little ride. Again, uh, with uh, with all the other ones, I'll put the uh, the link in the description. Uh, take you to V Skylabs uh, website, so you can go download this thing. It's a uh, it's it's a good time. It's a fun little uh, fun little helicopter, and it would be good if you don't know how to fly and you're looking at getting into the Sims. Um, it's a good one to start with. Honestly, it's it's nice and easy to fly, but it still has all the effects of a real helicopter, and uh, it'd be a good little trainer. I'm gonna shoot it down here. Oh, high RPM. Look at the stadiums. All right, let's see. All right, and I'm just gonna turn around. Whoop! Oh, lost my tail rotor almost. Well, couldn't hard tell how high off the ground I was. Uh, okay, so here's our stadium. And let's pick up out of here. All right, a little more, a little more. Come on, come on. Before, let's get some airspeed. Yeah, this thing's fun. This thing's fun. Let's go over to the Capitol building real quick. Look at our flat terrain. Oh, look at that bridge. It's hard to see, almost. Let's see, look at that one. That one's got some weird stuff happening. This is definitely something you could not get away with in this part of town. All right, here we go. And got some speed. Let's pull a little power. And around the Capitol building. I bet if I tried to land on it, I'd go through it. It's all right. I'm going to zip on down here. Whenever I'm in DC, I always try to barrel roll over the monument, so we're gonna give it a shot. One thing I find myself doing because of the the frame line right down the middle of the windscreen, I got both my eyes trying to look around it, so I'm actually looking at the monument with one eye. Alright, a little more power. Speed's pretty good, look at that 95. And get some altitude here. All right. Here we go. Oh, uh oh. Almost broke it. Oh, uh oh. Now it's a low RPM. <laughs> Don't try this at home, kids. There, reflection pond. And I'll plop it down over here at the old Lincoln and uh, call it a day. But uh, I'm, I'm really liking this. So far, we're a win, 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 win with all the, uh, the V Skylabs product. I'm starting off with all the helicopters and then I'll get into the other aircraft they have. They got airplanes, gyroplanes, aerocopters, I mean, all kinds of stuff. So it's a uh, big selection, big selection. So uh, again, I'm going to put the link to this one in the in the description down there, and uh, so you can go pick it up because it's it's a fun ride. All right, all right, and out here. Oh, that wasn't very pretty. All right, then all the way down. Well, hello, Mr. Lincoln. Whew. All right. Just pause here. And you got oculus hair and probably eyeballs, but no worries. So 
first impression of the the Mini 500 is cool. I I bet uh, I bet it flies a lot like the real thing. Uh, I'd I'd like to hop in one um, and uh, and find out for sure. But uh, you know, as the time rolls on, I'll probably fly different things, fly a bunch of things, be able to compare more and more. So you know, that'd be cool. But again, uh, I'm gonna put it in the description. I know I said that uh, once or thrice, but uh, I'm gonna throw it down there so you can go pick this thing up if you like, and uh, that'd be awesome. Again, thanks to uh, V Skylabs for sending me these uh, these products. It's uh, really cool of you, and so I'm gonna do my best to to do these uh, reviews and stuff. Not really so much a full review as just a first impression, and then you know, really the ones that I like to do, I'll dig in a little bit deeper on. And uh, always open to suggestions too. If you want to see any of the other ones or any other payware at all or freeware, uh, just let me know and uh, I'll check it out. I'll put the Pro Flight Trainer Puma to the test and uh, my Oculus Rift and all that. And uh, you know, we'll get it going. I hope you liked the video. I'm uh, Joshua from Hamby Aeronautics. And uh, if you liked it, if you know, if you don't mind, you know, you can click like that to help me out. And then uh, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more Hellasim videos and other Sim videos. And just other videos. I'm Joshua again from Hemby Aeronautics. We'll see ya.